movement to be more like the Perot and Paul factions than uh, than a long term thing, or uh, would you uh, would you expect it to grow into something? I, I you know I don't know. I know that these um, in my travels around the state, the people that, who are identifying with this movement are patriotic, hardworking people who are frustrated and don't trust the government. That's been around in Missouri as long as I can remember. Um, not trusting the government is part of our DNA in Missouri. It's, it's, uh, I think it's one of the reasons we were called the show me state. Um, the, you know, people in Missouri are st stubbornly hold on to their independence and don't think uh, government is, is, is the end all be all. So I think the sentiment is going to remain. How organized they're going to be as a, as a political party remains to be seen. Um, I, I think there will be, uh, what we'll really be telling is how many votes the Constitution Party gets this year on the ballot. Um, I think many people will um, uh, look at the Constitution Party, which is a party that will be on our ballot, as uh, the one that most closely fits uh, what they believe about government and what they think government should and shouldn't be doing. And so we'll see in November uh, how, many, how many votes the Constitution Party gets.